I got a doctor's appointment in the morning. So Yeah, this is going to get plugged in. that charging now this all right where is the Yeah, this is going inside. That's going inside. I'm just going to have to buy Yeah. Mm -hmm. Buy a damn fan. All right, it's after six p.m. And where's the car? I need to get out here and clean this yard up. They ain't gonna do it. They ain't gonna do it. I'm going to Publix. Get me some creamer. Maybe a cup of coffee if they got any. Um, I think I'm going to go this way just in case they got something hanging on them. Am I? got an argument this morning with my oldest baby my daughter uh, I really need to stop commenting about family stuff, you know. Well, I guess my reason being that most of the time my subscribers come down on my side and I, that's 
That's not right. Well, I guess, I don't know. I just need to stop bringing that stuff into it. You know, families always have arguments about stuff. This time it was about my oldest grandson, the one with cerebral palsy. He, for the most part, he does cleaning, you know, the household cleaning up and stuff. Somewhat. He's limited as to how good he can do it. But the one dog we got left, if she doesn't get put out on a regular basis, she messes in the floor. And, uh, most of the time it's in the living room or one of the bathrooms or something like that. When she does, sometimes she'll go a long time and not do it, but that's because I'm letting her out and stuff. But the thing is, I can't think to let I let her out first thing in the morning and I let her out uh, around 8 o'clock at night and then I let them back in and my uh, I wonder if I need to I picked one up the other day like that. I'm going to get off the road right about here. But my grandson... If I'm not sleeping in my room that night or something, he'll close that door. He'll put her in my room and close that door so that she poops or messes up. She'll do it. She'll do it on on my turf. Thinking then I got to clean it up. And that's why he does that. That's why he'll shut her up in my room. Why am I picking up trash? But, and sure enough, last night I was sleeping on the sofa again. So he showed her up in my room. And she did a job in there and right behind the door. So when I opened the door, it just went stringing out all through the floor there. And I was raising Cain about it because that's why he does it. So he'll do it in there or she'll do it in there. And now, I didn't bring that dog to the house. I didn't, that's, but the, since that dog likes me and all that stuff more than she does the rest of them, it's my dog. Well, it's not, I didn't bring the dog in there. And she said, well, get rid of her. Well, now she was the one doing all the boohooing when she had a dislocated ship. 
uh, hilt and everything, so then it was her dog. Well, it's not my dog. It's not my dog that that I uh, remember to put water out for and all that stuff. And I, I see Michelle has Michelle's that lady that come out here the other day. I was cleaning up in the driveway and everything and I told her I occasionally get stuff out of her trash and she didn't seem to mind and I don't see nothing in there this time but boy she was she's a sweetie <laughs> she's wow when I seen her, you know, when I was like in my early teens and I seen a girl and I was in, really got, I won't say the hot, but you know what I mean, you really liked her. Well, that's kind of how it was when I laid eyes on Michelle. I'm like, wow. Oh my goodness. She's a sweetie. <laughs> She's a sweetie. Matter of fact, I'm trying to think of a reason that I need to go up into her yard and maybe have a little conversation or something with her again, you know. It's a pretty thing. Woo-woo. <laughs> I mean, woo-woo, I see trash, not woo-woo. Why is this all spread out like that? Dad, I ain't equipped to handle all this stuff. I guess I will, though. Dad, gonna Looks like boxes of little Debbie's. Oh, God. I didn't set out to do this. I was going to Publix to get me some creamer and maybe a cup of coffee since I've not had any coffee today. Alright, Dubber, let's get moving. You in. They supposed to cut that coffee off at <clears throat> 7 o'clock and it's after 6. Now see, there's a classic example. I was talking about stuff with the family and the dog. Then and now I got off on something else and then something else. See how easy it is for me to get off track. Just crazy how I get off track. I can't stay focused on... Well, I get distracted. What the world is that? Is that dog? No, that ain't, that's tree limb dog poo. I ain't never seen no dog poo that big. Um, I need to go down that side of the road one day and, and pick up trash. Ain't nobody gonna pick it up. Even the people that live there, they ain't picking it up. Oh, uh, yeah, I got my new side view mirrors. I guess you can see that. They want to jiggle around too much. All right. There's the egg carton for crying out loud. Am I still recording? I'm not talking to my own recording. Sometimes I might be talking to myself. Sometimes I've got some trash now for Publix. And I'm assuming that most of this came from Publix. And I guess I could say from 
Publix that came and and to Publix it shall return. I don't know what that is, it's trash. Somebody's burning something somewhere, I can smell it. And that ain't a grilling smell, that is burning trash. There's a can down there, but being the time of day, I'm not gonna go after it, I'll go after it. There's three cans. I will pick up trash as I see it. Yes, I will, if I can reach it. I got my good pickup stick, the only one I got left. I'm gonna do that glue trick on them things again, but I'm gonna do it like I was supposed to do it and not ruin the last one. There's a $20 scratch off. I cannot believe people are spending that much for a scratch off card. Back when I was doing it, it was dollar cards. But not anymore. Up. Oh, I can reach that blue bottle. I'm going to get that blue bottle. Oh, what in the heck am I getting them blue bottles for? Wow. See that Steve Diamond, one of my blue bottles? Oops. And I didn't have to dig for it. I just had to reach out there and get it. Now, what am I going to do with it? I don't have a clue what I'm going to do with it. I know what I'm doing with six of them, but... I have got, why is this is one, sorry. I'm gonna fix that drill. I'll start fixing that tonight. I'll start fixing that tonight. Get over there to the pub and get that trash can and get in there and get me a cup of coffee. I sure hope there's some in there. Because I need a cup. Because I have a sneaking idea I'm going to be up late working on a video I'm trying to put together. Yes, I am. Uh, there was that one of them. Uh, <laughs> oh, boy. Never know when them suckers is coming. Anyhow. Nasty burp. Nasty burp. Now I'll get in here and get me some coffee. And I done got off track again. I don't know what in the world I'm. All right, let's shoot this. Doing, dear? Yeah, 
How you doing, ma'am? How are you? You have a good day. What's left of it anyway? Looks like there might be some coffee there. What? I'm going to... What? I'm going to check it out. There's some nice coffee in there. I'm going to snag Ain't hardly any creamer in there. How you doing, ma'am? You have a good day. There I go again. <laughs> Every time I pass the ladies, I think about FBG. <laughs> I've got to figure something out. about my live stream because when I have my um, live stream at 2.15 on Saturday guess what It's like Sunday morning in the a.m. and I mean like early. I have to be there, you know, with all those people that are spending most of their time on their cell phone while they sit there on the bench. So that means FBG is asleep and he would have to get up to get into that. So I'm trying to figure out a time. Maybe I need to do a whole new different live stream with people that's... Who else would be in that time zone? Things are a dollar sixty nine a pound. So does that mean that was almost bad? I like stuff like that, folks, but I, I swear I can't afford it. I can't afford it. By the way, I did notice that my grandson, Ellison, had come in there and cleaned up that pile of poop. Um, what was all of that? I love that. Is that a bulb? What is that called? A sort of, uh, it ain't called that. I don't know what the... 
I want to know what it is. A sorted boilish. I know what that, that's weeping pig there. I got one more here. If everybody want to get one? Yes, sir. Four fifty-five. Okay. Let me get over here to it. Uh, just lean it in there any kind of way you can. There you go. That'll do. That'll do. How many hearts did you break when you were in high school? I'm still in high school. What? Yes, sir. I'm, go I'm in my senior year. You're still in school? Yes, sir. <laughs> you look a little older than that. I'm only 17. Really? Yes, sir. Oh, you're still breaking hearts then. <laughs> <laughs> you have yes, a good sir. day, dear. Have a good one. You sure are pretty. I think Thank I you. told you that, though. Still in high school. What about that? Well, that caught me off guard. She's still in high. She's still breaking hearts. She knows she's breaking hearts. <laughs> That's all right, dear. That's all right. I'm going to lay my stick right there. I'm going to fix me another. Well, first off, I'm going to stick that in there. Ah, uh, she kind of she kind of looks old. Not old, but older than 17. Yes, I'm hogging the coffee. I'm hogging the coffee. And I need a cup to mix it with. Okay, you're gonna get a carriage? Oh Lord, I spilled okay. coffee. Go ahead. Oh my God! What? I'm in trouble. What? Built coffee, and it went right down in the seat between my legs. So I ain't gonna discuss what I burnt. That going. Good Lord. How you doing, sir? Here. 
reflecting on today's events. I'm trying to think of a time. Let's see. At 2.15, two that means Big Keg is in the bed sleeping probably at about 1 or 2 o'clock in the morning. So I have it at 2.15 on Saturday. And it's already Sunday. Sarah, how you doing, ma'am? You have a good day, dear. You too. So, if I could have it at, say, five or six in the evening, that would get, that would get Big Keg up. <clears throat> Big Keg could join in then. So family, y'all tell me if I move the start time to if I move the start time say to five or six o'clock p.m. Eastern Time, my time, that means uh, that would cover a lot of my subscribers. Uh, that means it would be 10 or 11 o'clock in Europe and England and places like that and Holland. Uh, Boy, the logistics is terrible trying to figure this out. You know, you can't please everybody, but I hate to leave anybody behind. How y'all doing? Good. Have a good day. Thank you. How you doing, sir? Good. How about you? I'm doing. Did you take them carts out? My wife took one out. I and you brought them back. them back. You're a nice fella. Thank you. Consider it. Thank you, sir. You have a good day, sir. Me too. Don't see many people doing that. I know that Publix, their employees spend a lot of time going out to the parking lot and rounding them things up and bringing them back in. Um, they spend a lot of time doing that. For no reason. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I swear she don't look like a Korean to me though. She looks like a uh, uh, well, she looks like a lady. How you doing, ma'am? All right. All right. You have a good day. You too. I'll be right back in. How you doing, sir? All right. Fine. Take care. Michelle looks like she looks like a black lady. Uh, she's a Korean now. She was born in Korea. I thought she was a black lady the first time I met her. And then, and she's the one told me one time when we first met. She said, "Where are you from?" And I said, "North Carolina." She said, no, what are you? She said, you don't talk like an American. <laughs> she said, I didn't sound American. <laughs> I still get a chuckle out of that. People think I'm nuts sitting here talking to myself. But we know I'm not talking to myself. <laughs> How you doing, ma'am? Nice you? tats. Thank you. I bet those took a while, didn't they? Sure did. What does stuff like that cost these days? I don't know. When I got them in Texas, they were probably about three fifty to. Oh, and this one was two fifty. Oh was Lord, I'm I'm thinking back when you could get one for twenty bucks. Yeah, no, not now. <laughs> that was back in the fifties. Right. <laughs> you have a great day. You have a good day, dear. head to the house. Oops, I gotta turn my scooter on. How y'all doing? How was the baby? Six months. Okay. It's just waiting. Well, I think that's all my, you know, somebody's wrecked into, no, they ain't. That was just a reflection. How you doing, sir? Good. Hey, you the doing? Navy man. Yeah. You doing all right? I'm doing fine. I'll watch it. Don't spill your coffee. <laughs> yeah. I'm doing fine. Yeah, me too, I guess. I got me a hat ordered so everybody know I'm a vet. What, what service were you in? I was in the Army. Army? Yeah. I we just got, got this here one brand new. Really? And you? It's one day old. Yeah. 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 I got I had a friend of mine come down from Atlantic Beach, Florida. Mm-hmm. They went to, to the VA center over there and they got this for me. Yeah. I'm, I got me one order. Okay. I'll see you later, my friend. I okay. gotta get to the house before it okay. gets too dark. Okay. Somebody run into me. I swear it is muggy out here. How you doing, ma'am? Pretty good, are you? You have a good day.